Hello everybody, welcome to the video. If you're blind or illiterate and you can't read my name, my name is Wunda and today I'm going to be showing you how to increase FPS in League of Legends. So, you know, League of Legends overall isn't that taxing on your PC. In other words, you know, you can have a really weak computer and it'll still be able to run League of Legends pretty well. But the thing is with this game specifically, when there's team fights, when there's a lot of things happening, the game is going to have a lot of frame drops and you can't have that happening. You want, you know, it to stay consistently at 60 FPS when a lot of things are happening because if you miss something like a split second late you don't see someone doing an ability their ultimate you don't see someone moving somewhere or doing something specific you're gonna be at a massive disadvantage so you're gonna have to have it as consistent as possible that's why I'm gonna be showing you how to get it as consistent as possible and as high as possible so you can have the best experience in your time with League of Legends so first thing you got to do is just jump into League of Legends now once you're in League of Legends the first thing you're gonna want to do is you're gonna go to play then create a custom match and then just make one of these go into summoners rift then continue and then add a bunch of bots in. Now the reason we're actually in a custom match and we have a bunch of bots in is so we can simulate a regular match so we can have the FPS as normal as it should because if it's only 1v1 or it's a training match it's going to run a lot quicker because you don't have 5v5 all with different abilities and different things happening at the same time. So once you get all these guys in just click start game. You can choose whoever it doesn't really matter you know the FPS stays practically the same for everyone same thing with the rest of your team. So you could just lock in and just get ready to play. Now as you can see, everybody already left. I don't really care. It's a bot game. I don't really have to help my team. But what we're going to do is we're actually going to press escape or ask or whatever you have it binded to, whatever it brings up your menu. We're going to click that. We're going to go to video. Then this is where all the magic happens. So you re usually it's going to be on very high. So let's test that out. Now as we can see, it looks very pretty, pretty cute. It looks pretty nice, pretty nice. However, you know, our FPS really isn't good, and that's pretty bad, especially when you're like one of you wanting someone or doing abilities and it's a team fight, you know, as I said before. So what we're going to actually change is we're actually going to change a few things. First thing, we're going to try bringing down the graphics quality. I'll just bring it all the way down to very low because I know that looks pretty, doesn't look that bad, but um, it still has a massive FPS boost. So let's try that. Now, as we can see, it's about 40 FPS up top, uh, or 35, 40 FPS. So that's pretty all right, but it's not nearly good enough as we want it for team fights. And also, obviously, I am recording, so it's going to bring bringing it down. But I just want it to be as consistent as possible and be higher than 60 FPS. So when we get into those team fights, I don't lose because my frames aren't showing me what is really happening in the game. So the next step after you've tried all this, you brought it all the way down to very low, but it's not as low as you want. You go to resolution. This has a very big effect. Obviously, it's bring down. The amount of pixels so the less pixels the more the less it is uh taxing on your console C computer so you can just test whichever ones you think is gonna work i'll just try uh this one because it seems like it's the next step and going down to bring our fps up so let's try that it might move your screen in a few wonky directions but now that it's done let's just see our fps it's a little bit higher but not as high as we want it so we'll keep going down until i can record at a perfect 60 fps or higher 47 we still don't like that we got to bring it down we're gonna jump all the way down to 720p now they're at 720p it's 90 fps and while i'm recording so that's really not bad i actually quite like that and 720p does not look that bad especially for a game like league of legends which already isn't the most beautiful compared to a lot of modern games so uh yeah that's pretty much how you do it you can bring it down all the way to however much you want you can put it down all the way to the lowest setting and that works this is actually uh, 4x3 so it's gonna look a little bit different it's actually more square of a monitor if you have it it's made for more square monitors for they don't really sell those in 2018 anymore but yeah that's pretty much how you do it it's pretty simple it's pretty easy and yeah League of Legends is already very optimized which is one of the reasons it's one of the most played games in the world aside from the fact that it's free but now that you made these changes, it probably won't be too low. I don't think you can have the worst resolution that allows you and then have lowest graphic settings, but it's not like a perfect 60 FPS or above. I don't know what kind of computer you must have for that. Probably, uh, probably a smart fridge or something, but you know, uh, let's put all that aside. That's pretty much how you do it. Thank you guys so much for watching. It means a lot that you checked me out. And, uh, if you liked the video or it helped you, don't forget to like the video. Subscribe if you want to subscribe. It's your choice, but subscribe. And don't forget to comment if you want me to have any suggestions of what I should do or, you know, you have any questions, concerns, all that, leave in the comments or reply to every one of them. And yeah, I will see you fellas later, hopefully. You probably won't check out my videos ever again, but I hope you do.